Good morning, third grade. All right, we're not gonna have a typical Harry Potter read aloud because I'm going to show you what I've been doing while I was trying to record the read aloud. This is Sunny. She is one of the happiest llamas on the farm. Um, typically, this morning I came out to find her breathing really horribly. There'll be a video of that in just a second. I suspected choke. Llamas don't choke like people do. Their airways are not, uh, or they can still breathe while they're choking. So naturally I called the emergency vet out and had them come and look at Sunny. Uh, when they got there, she was breathing really horribly, and then we found an abscess behind her ear, um, kind of by her jaw. An abscess is a point of infection that grows and grows and grows, and it's full of pus. This video is really graphic, so please turn it off now if you don't like seeing blood. You're about to hear the noise that Sunny was making. And so I shaved down the area where that abscess was with my razors and you can see that big lump and how it's swollen and a little bit discolored. And here we cut into the abscess. You have to puncture it and push a hole on the outside. You, it's technically called lancing. And so we lance the abscess to try and give a place for the pus and the infection to drain out of. You can see the vet's gloved up. She's got all her proper equipment on. She's going in with the blade and making a little slice. And we did give her some numbing, um, so she can't feel all of it, but she is really stressed out, and you'll see her fighting. And, oh, yeah. the vet puts a little bit of pressure on it, and you can see all that infection that's coming out. There was actually so much infection, I didn't catch it all on camera, there was so much infection inside here, oh, there it comes, there it comes, um, that it was pressing up against her throat. Can you imagine having a mass in like kind of in your tonsil area pressing up against your throat so hard that you can barely breathe? This happened just overnight. And here Sunny's jumping around because, you know, kind of hurts and she's really stressed. And we get it all the way cleared out. Here the vet's gonna go in with her finger and we're gonna press along the outsides to push all that infection outside that hole. And I think another glob is about to come out. Ooh. There it goes. Yep. yep. Holy cow. Makes your stomach queasy. Hey, hey. Hey. The good thing is that while she looks like she's covered in blood, she actually feels so much better and she can breathe properly again. Sunny is safe and sound. She's happy and I'll continue to clean this out. Anyway, I hope that you guys have a great day. Um, uh, stay safe. And I will continue with our read aloud tomorrow.